Spotify is a commercial music streaming service that provides digital rights management protected. The service can run on OSX software as well as Linux, Windows, iOS, Android, Blackberry, and much, much more. From a user experience when I first used the software, I wasn't very impressed with it. In fact, I thought of it much like an online radio station service, much like Pandora services. But after tinkering with the software for a bit and searching for some of my favorite bands, I started seeing the positive side to Spotify. Before we begin, one of the downsides of this application is that you have to pay for services on the mobile market. It doesn't affect me much considering I don't have a smart device, but for those who want to listen to music on the go, I am sorry to say but you're better off getting Pandora radio application. At least it does the same thing for free. When I first heard of this software, it was mentioned in a tweet by one of my friends. After pondering about it for a moment, I started to browse Facebook. When I went on to Facebook, I saw some small icons under a person's status saying that they recently used Spotify and liked a band. After seeing the software mentioned twice, I decided to go with my gut and just give it a shot. After installing the program and logging into my Facebook, I saw I had the option to follow my friends and what kind of music they like. I didn't see the point in that because it already mentions it in my Facebook homepage what they already like. Some of the things you can do with the software is actually quite amazing. There is just one thing I wish you could do, or if you can do it, I just don't know how to, but that is to create a playlist and be able to listen to the music you add onto it. You have the option to be able to add it to a queue, but once you play it, it goes away. So if you forgot what song you were listening to and you just can't go back and be able to re-listen to it, it's kind of a bummer. They have some cool options for social media to be able to tell your friends what kind of bands you like or what music you have listened to last, but I like to keep that kind of stuff a mystery. It makes it challenging for people to kind of guess what I like. Now, I know what you're thinking. What kind of music does this software provide? So far, I was able to find some of my favorite bands like Audio Slave, Daft Punk, and Limp Bizkit, just to name a few, and it seems to have a lot of good music, even some older albums. But some of the songs you want may have been done by other people, such as Killing in the Name of by Rage Against the Machine. If you are ever busy and you don't have music on your computer, but you have internet access, I would give this software a try. It will keep you entertained and even have you bobbing your head to the rhythm of the music. And who knows, you might find some other bands you might just like.